Hey, in this tutorial, I am going to talk about what is the props in React. In the previous video, I already discussed about components. What are the components? I already discussed in the previous video. How to create a class-based component, normal component. Okay, so in this video, I am talking about props in React. So what is the props? So this is the official website of React documentations. I already talked about components in the previous video. So the components, they accept arbitrary input and this called props. Okay, so just see an example of props. So these are our component. Okay, so this is the header name and this is the heading.js and this is our component here be learning and you can see here and this is, this is our component for header. Okay, so if I change this, welcome and now save this so you can see here welcome okay so now i remove this here okay so now go to the app.js okay so here i just pass head equal and just pass a string so just pass a string name welcome okay so now go to heading.js and here at first type props okay and here i just type p r o p s props dot head okay so you have to put this in a curly bracket so if you save this so now you can see here props dot head so just put this inside a curly bracket okay so now save this you can see welcome and this is our string okay welcome so welcome to website okay so now save it okay welcome to website you can see here so in this way you can pass the data in a component okay so i just copy this and here paste this and now this time i change this and now type blr name okay so now save this you can see here be learning okay so this time i just pass be learning string okay so now come to the class base component okay so this is our class base component i already discussed in the previous video so here go to app.js and now this is book body means body.js this class based component so i put here a uh, props so just name it des for description and now just pass this is body okay now i pass the string okay you can pass the function you can pass the anything by props okay so now go to body.js and here i just remove all of this okay so what is the react fragment i already discussed in the previous video this return will only return one html element okay so here i just pass p r o p s props dot and props dot what props dot des and des is what des is this okay so i just pass this data by des so now go to body.js here i just type des but in the class based component you have to put this before props okay otherwise it will not work okay so now save it and you can see this is removed and now just save this this is body okay you can see it this is body okay so you can change this string also so this is first line of body okay now save this okay so now so just remember for the class based component you have to type this dot props dot and your variable okay so now here i just copy it and paste it here and this time i just passed another thing this is second line of body okay so now save it and you can see this is second line of body okay 
so you can design it by yourself okay i just show you how can you use these props okay here i just want to clear your basic concept about react so this is a very basic concept about props and i will upload a more tutorial about react and also i will upload tutorial about django rest framework with react and that will be more interesting thing okay so thanks for watching this video see you in next tutorial thank you and don't forget to subscribe my channel